Hello. Uh, my name is Dr. Gill, and I've been asked to do an examination of your chest, looking at your lungs today. Is that okay? Yeah. So, to start off with, could you confirm your name and date of birth, please? Matt Thompson, 411-89. Okay. And do you have any problems with your breathing at the moment? No. Perfect. So, to start off, I'd like to have a look at your hands, if I might. Just having a look to see if there's anything untoward there. That's good. And if you could turn your hands over, please. Terrific. If you could put your fingers together, like so. Super. And hands all the way out in front with your wrists cocked back for me. Nice and straight for me. Okay, there's no problems there. If you just relax down for me, let me take your pulse. Okay, so your pulse and breathing rate are both normal. I'd like to do your blood pressure for that, okay? Do you have any problems with this arm? No. Super. Bring that over. Put that on there. And just go around. And we're going to do this twice. Once without the stethoscope and once with. Okay, so tell me if there's any problems at all. Okay, and we're going to come back down again. That's fine. Now we're going to do the same again. Okay, right. So we're just going to have a quick look at your neck, if that's okay. So if you could lean your head back for me and turn your head to look that way. Just having a look if there's any changes on your neck there. And that's fine. Now I need to push push on your uh, tummy. Do you have any problems down, down there at all? No. Nope. Okay, so just turn your head over. And one, two, three, push. Okay, that's fine. If you could swing your legs up, I need to have another look at your neck. I'm just going to see if there's any lumps and bumps anywhere. Just tell me if there's any pain or discomfort. Mm -hmm. That's fine. If you could shrug your shoulders up, please, and relax down. Just checking in front of the ears, and behind, and then at the back. That's all good. So if you could lean back on the bed for me again. I'm just going to have a look over your face now. Okay, so relax your head back. Mm -hmm. And if you could just look up for me. That's fine. And then down. Terrific. If you could show me your tongue. Okay, and then put it to the roof of your mouth. That's fine. So we're going to have a look at your chest now. So if you could take your shirt off for me. Okay, and sit up straight, and do a nice deep breath in, and out. Any problems with that? No. Perfect. So if you just lean back for me. Okay. So I'm just going to put my hands around your chest, okay, and take a deep breath in for me, and out. And we're just going to have a quick look at the base of your neck. This might feel a little bit uncomfortable, okay? Okay, that seems normal. Terrific. And I'm going to tap across your chest. I'm now going to have a listen, so if you could just breathe in and out nicely through the mouth, please. That's all good. So I'm now going to put my hand on your chest. I'm going to see the position of your heart. Okay. That's normal. Again, I'm just going to put my hand there. 
That's all fine. If you could sit up, please. I'm going to tap across the back of your chest. If you could fold your arms across your chest, please. Okay, so I'm just going to percuss around. Okay, that all sounds good. And now breathing once again, in and out, slowly through the mouth. Say one, two, please. One, two. One, two. One, two. Okay. And if you can uh, do a deep breath in for me. And out. Okay, if you swing your legs back up on the bed. Just going to have a quick look down here. Just going to press in there. Okay, that's fine. Okay, so that completes our examination. I could find no unusual findings. Thank you very much for your time. Do you have any other questions for me? No. Perfect. We'll leave it there. Thank you.